Cal Island ISD Food Services has some great information on their website. To get to it, just go to the Cal Island ISD website, scroll down, and click on this icon here. You can also get to this information from your child's campus website. Go ahead and click on the icon, and there is a lot of useful information here. If you scroll towards the bottom, you have some more options. This icon here will allow you to log into your student's lunch account, make deposits, or view their lunch activity. This app here will take you to the online version of the lunch application for free or reduced lunch. This is actually the preferred method. As soon as you click submit, that will be sent to the Kellen ISD Food Services. If you would like a hard copy, you can always click this link here. This last option right here is the application and you can save it to your documents or print. Foodie the Food Bot is just a game for children. It talks about foods that they're eating and what nutrients or vitamins that food contains. Nutrition lessons focuses on a food of the month, gives you a little bit more information and some recipes, and that is offered in both English and Spanish. In the spotlight, just talks about what's going on as far as food nutrition for that week. Now to get in-depth information about your child's menu, go ahead and click here. Select your school. And then click go to menu. And it will take you to an interactive menu. Looking at the menu up here on the top, you can actually select a language. So if your preferred language is Spanish, you can choose Spanish here, and it will translate everything to Spanish. Here you can change the school if you have a child at another campus. Simply mousing over a food item, you will get all of the nutrition facts for that item. The nutrition facts also include allergens, and you can do this for any food item. When you click on the nutrient calculator, and let's say I want to find out how many calories I'm consuming, if I select cheeseburger, and I know I've selected it because it's highlighted blue, tater tots, salad, maybe an apple, some chocolate milk, ketchup, and mustard. Scroll down and you can see the total counts for those food options that I'm going to consume for that lunch. I can print this or just simply close. Now, if I have some food allergies, I can click on this option here. You'll see this pop-up window. Just click I agree. So now if I'm allergic to milk, I will select milk and it will cross out all of the food items that have dairy. On this page, you also have meal prices. The Android and iOS app are available for your devices. Again, from the menu, you do have the option to go to Lunch Money Now, which is where you can make deposits for your student's lunch account. And you also have the option to click on the online lunch application for free or reduced lunch. If you have any questions concerning food services, please do not hesitate to contact them.